one more video for tonight. I, I, I got bombed. Absolutely lost. Connie Francis record. She had a very minor hit in 1969 as her contract with MGM was running out. And uh, the song is called Wedding Cake. Connie Francis, number 98 on Billboard's Hot 100 the week of March 22, 1969. Connie Francis uh, hit records back in the late 50s and early 60s. Vacation. V-A-C-A-T-I-O-N. That was pretty cool. A Stupid Cupid, which was written by Neil Sadaka and Howard Greenfield. She had a hit with that. My Happiness, uh, Who's Sorry Now, one of her signature hits, a song that was written way back in 1923, originally covered by Bill Banks and his Rith Makers. That was back in 1932. Billy Banks, rather, and his Rith Makers back in 32. And uh, there was Everybody, Somebody's Full. That was one of her best known hits. And there was Among My Souvenirs, yet another remake. A number one hit originally for Paul Whiteman back in 1928. Connie Francis bringing it back uh, about 30 year, about 30, 32, 33 years later or so, and uh, we get to 1969 now. And uh, after the British invasion, well, even before the British invasion, she started to lose some momentum. But she continued to record faithfully for the MGM label. She just got burned out on it. 1969, she's been at it. She was at it for about 15 years. Non-stop recording, non-stop live appearances on television, live shows, concerts. You need a break. She needed a break. So she went into semi-retirement. 1969, 1970. Although she did come back in 1973 with a song called Should I Tie a Yellow Ribbon Around the Old Oak Tree, which was an answer song to the Tony Orlando and Don record. 1969 though, wedding cake, Connie Francis. If you listen real close to the, listen to the rhythm of this record, the melody, there's a hint, a hint of "Gentle on My Mind" by Glenn Campbell and the melody of this record. Got as high as number 91. That's it. On Billboard's Hot 100 for four weeks, number 98. The week of March 22nd, 1969. Connie Francis with wedding cake.